Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I hope everybody's having a great Thursday. Um, today I wanted to come on and do kind of a different video. The other day I had gotten my Christmas bin from the garage and I was pawing through it um, looking for some items for some Christmas and July product uh, projects that I was working on and um, I thought it would be kind of fun to show what is in my Christmas bin. Um, a lot of this stuff, of course, I've hoarded and I've had, you know, accumulate year after year. Of course, all the after Christmas sales or whatever, and I go and shop and, you know, can't just buy one of everything. You have to buy like two or three of everything. But as we all do as crafters, we accumulate stuff and, um, I almost dumped my pen here. Um, and of course, we get it on clearance at the end of Christmas, and then we put it in a bin and we store it all year and save it for the next Christmas. Well, my goal this year is to use what's in this bin. Um, this doesn't include. I have you know dies and stamps. Um, and also the paper pads that I want to use up too. But this was just, I thought just doing the particular bin um, would be fun. Cause I know that we all have our storage bins as crafters and um, I just thought it would be fun to see what was in here. Um, because it's kind of like actual Christmas when you open it up after a year and you forget what you have. So I'll try to show you, I have it sitting in a chair, the bin, it's just one of those plastic storage bins mm -hmm. and I just pawed through this it was packed a lot neater it looks a mess now um, but yeah I, I kind of tore it all up but these two boxes were actually on the bottom and it was all nice and pretty or whatever so I that's why I put them on top because they were technically included in the bin so let's start with these and there's no I there's going to be no rhyme or reason to these because, as I said, I pawed through them and it's unorganized. But it is what it is, and hopefully I'll use all this stuff up and we can start fresh um, next year. Because there's always something new coming out. There's always new um, collections coming out. And even as me as a crafter, my style evolves, or, you know, like this year. Um, Santa Baby has come out and those are the nice soft pinks and the blues and the mint greens where you're gonna see in most of in this box I'm most you know have the traditional um, a lot of the traditional colors so it's kind of me changing as well um, I really like playing with the um, the new softer colors um, in addition to obviously the the, the traditional red, white, and green colors too. Um, so yeah, I just want to use all this stuff up and get rid of it and, you know, make room for new. That's what I definitely want to do. So let's get started. Um, in this bin, let's see what I have here. I have this stamp set, which is really cute. Never used. I opened it, but I never used it. Got it looks like got it at Tuesday morning. It's a really cute stamp set, so I really want to try to make something with this. These would be great for cards. So I've got some stamps. Here's some old recollections, dimensional stickers. I got these on clearance. And this, 2013. See, this is what I'm hoarding. Whoops, sorry, I didn't mean to shake the camera. Some Pier 1 trim, and this is really pretty trim to you, so I have to use that. Um, some twine. Again, this is old twine from 2013. Um, just a set of random embellishments and some card. Looks like oops, looks like some cards. Or I don't know stuff that I've had packed away. Oh, that's kind of cute. Yeah. Um, ribbon galore. I have so much ribbon. I think I have a few Halloween items in here too. This is black. That should be Halloween. 
But I've got ribbon. Here's some more ribbon. Washi tape. Look at that unused washi tape. Need to use that. Twine, a whole mess of twine. I think I'm set for twine. Yeah, I think we all should use what we have. How nice would that be? This is some trim from Hobby Lobby. And look, from 2015. So I've just been hoarding this. It's really cute, too. And I think they still have, you know, they'll probably have it this year, too. They have the same stuff. So I've got that. More washi to use. This is the traditional playful type washi with Santa and the reindeer. So I have that to use. Oh, some more trim from Michael's 2015. So that's in there. More Hobby Lobby trim. All the stuff to use. Plenty of stuff to use. I really more twine. I really don't need to buy any more. More ribbon. I think I'm going to be doing a lot of ribbon tassels. I haven't really made any of those and I've got enough ribbon to to um, really make some. Here's some washi tape galore. Washi tape. Um, a cute little stamp set I got it Tuesday morning. That's really cute. I like the Santa Claus is coming to town. I did use that. So I've got that to use. Some doodlebug brads. I don't really use brads a lot. I need to use them. I'm sure there's lots of fun things that I could do with that. More twine and just some, here's some cutout pieces down there. So that's in that box. And then I have another box here, a box in a box. And look, look at all this ribbon. It's insanity. All that pretty ribbon I have to use. I gotta use this up. I think we all need to get into our stash and just use our stash. More ribbon here. I really like that, I really like this ribbon. That's really cute ribbon. Uh, the gingham. I like the gingham. Gingham green. And of course, that's cute. So I've got that. Oh, here we go. I'm a sucker for ribbon, I swear. Got this ribbon. How cute. Here's some random confetti, it looks like. They're silver deer. And... I'm set on tinsel ribbon, that's for sure. I'm set on my plaid ribbon, I think. Twine, of course I'm set on. There's twine, pom-pom, red pom-pom trim. Um, more ribbon, washi tape galore. Is that holidays, happy holidays? I don't use a lot of washi tape. I need to start using more. This is really cute washi tape, huh? To use that brand new. I think I grab these. I grab most of my stuff after, you know, after Christmas where it's dirt cheap. There's more there. Um, let's see. Oh, here's a little um, Santa hat that I had made with that um, cottage cuts die cut that I had showed on a previous video. And let's see. More ribbon. It's cute. It's almost like a, kind of like a rick, rick rack shape. And more washi. Washi, 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 never gonna run out of washi. Got some random Stampin' Up embellishments here. These are, oh, these are pretty. Completely forgot about these. Those are gonna be really cute to add some embellishments. Those are really pretty. And I've had these a while, too. 
I don't think they don't have those anymore. Um, and then this big ribbon and then this ho 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 stamp. So that's in there. Oh, and then Dollar Tree stickers galore in here. Here's some more um, Michael's trim. Stickers from Michael's. Cute little Santa. He's cute to play with. They usually have the same stuff. This is some Heidi Swap. Um, what is it? Printed vellum. They're like little vellum sheets, I guess. I think I grabbed these on an after Christmas ridiculous sale. Again, here's all my ribbon. Complete mess. More ribbon. Ribbon. Please tell me I'm not the only ribbon hoarder out there, especially for um, Christmas ribbon. Um, and any ideas, please share ideas what to do with this ribbon too. I would love that. I'm always open to suggestions to use up some ribbon, different ideas of what I can do with it. Um, let's see. This was a pack. It was a from Stampin' Up! and it's a kit. I didn't get the stamp sets for them, so it's just the card bases and the shaker material. So I can definitely find something to do with that. So I have this whole thing, never, never used. So I'll have to make do. I have to make use of that. Um, let's see, very old embellishments. These are really old. 2013, really cute though. Those would look cute on some rosettes, rosette centers. Um, a stencil, Tim Holtz stencil. And then this October afternoon background stamp, snow. I got to use this. I have some ideas for this. Um, but yeah, I have that in there. Oh, more twine. Ribbon, of course. Um, let's see. All these I have to use. This was at um, Michael's 2016, what, a couple years ago? Yeah, I never even used him. So he would be cute even for not even not using for Christmas. So I'll have to keep him aside. And let's see what's over here. Oh, the Heidi Swap Believe die. I have that. Um, I have this die. And then this is another Tuesday morning purchase. And these are a bunch of. Um, ephemera pieces and I guess you can spray um, you could it's for tattered angels you see those sprays there you could spray them on these pieces but I have a whole slew of these to use and you, you do your sprays I have some Heidi swap sprays I can use yeah those are cute look at that 49 pieces in here I have that um, a little Joy, this will be cute for Happy Mail. So it's like a little bag. I think this is from 31. So I got that. Glitter pad. Can never have too much glitter at Christmas, right? This is an older, this is an older pad. Well, 2016. So I probably got this after, you know, Christmas on sale. Another ephemera pack. Heidi Swap. So I got that. From a Dollar Tree, little pipe cleaners or tinsel stems, some balls, decorative balls. You can tell that I really was drawn to the the traditional colors. Oh, here's some Halloween stuff. Um, they're like little little notebooks. I got that. At, that was definitely probably an after Halloween purchase. Here's some older stamps, never used. That's really pretty to use for some cards, so I have to keep using that. And then this is an embossing folder. Got that. Here's some more Santa stickers. 
Here's a little stamp set that's got some really cute sentiments on it. Um, I got this at Michael's a year or two ago, I think. It's really cute. Some random, random stickers. Oh, I don't need these this year. In the Dollar Tree, I think they have them every year. So I'm stocked on those. More Santas. See what I mean? Oh, when you get those deals after Christmas, you just have to. It's hoarding. There's not. The, there's no way around it. It's hoarding. Definitely want to use this stuff up. More stickers. Another um, sheet of that vellum. Uh, let's see. Oh, these are cute little puppy stickers. I think this might be oh, 2015. And some word or letter. No, yeah, letter stickers. And then some Heidi Swap word stickers. And then a, um, this is really cute. This is a, um, it's like a stencil. You could use your, um, you know, the embossing paste and stuff like that on that. That's cute. It says glisten, sparkle, shine, glitter. I know I got these at like, I think Joanne's um, after Christmas one year. More Dollar Tree stickers. Another cute little Santa bag. Can use that for something. Um, yeah, we've got stickers. More stickers, 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 stickers. These are from Hobby Lobby. Tinsel. And then some, these are really old. These are some star embellishments here, chipboard shapes. This box is so random. Some more little ephemera. These are the cute colors. Um, they would look good on really anything. More ribbon. Um, oh my gosh, this ribbon is driving me nuts. Ribbon. I, I like the chevron rubber ribbon. See that? Chevron. And then this. I know I got this in a set on some other rolls. A couple other rolls. I got like a blue and silver um, little box, and then it was a red and plaid little box of this ribbon. And I got that a few years ago, so I know that that's been in here. And this is, let um, see, more ribbon. This is cute. This is like velour, velour ribbon. Um, let's see. Oh, there's some Halloween stuff in here. And I have a Halloween box somewhere, too, so I'll probably be doing a Halloween box. Look through. More tinsel stems. I don't know what's all over this, but there's some silver ribbon, uh, tissue sequins, uh, oh, some fun fur. I like that green. It's pretty. It's definitely a pretty color. Uh, more little Michaels belt pieces, some random gift bags, twine. This I think was, yeah, this is Valentine's Day. But with those colors, you could definitely use them for Christmas. I think I'm set with the red and white and green twine. That is a ton. And here's some gold. Balls. These would look cute with some confetti mixes. Oh my god, I have this random string here. It's 
straws. ribbon. Here's some glitter. Really paw it through this pretty good. This is a box of random um, gift card holders I made one year, I think a couple years ago. They were shaker gift card holders. So there's a ton of these in here. These are really fun to make. Oh, more Halloween. Some snow tax. I hope this stuff is still good. I've never opened it. Oh, so, we'll have to see how that is. Oh, Halloween. Some more twine. Oh my god, random stuff. This I think I got at a um it's like a little tag felt kit. I think I got it at one of the scrapbook stores here. Here's just some paper pieces and some tree confetti stickers. More twine. Oh my god, I do not need any more of that nonsense. Ribbon. Um... Oh my gosh. See you guys, it's just so, there's just ridiculous amount of craziness. So now you guys will have to show me yours because I can't just be thinking I'm the only crazy one here hoarding all this. These are cute. I'm going to do some, I have to paint these up. These are little ornaments. Um, cute little stamp. He's cute. More Heidi Swap. Um, here's a bin and a bin, another bin and a bin here. Let's see, I'm at 20 minutes. I'll keep a little faster. More ribbon. These I was making ornaments with um, last year, maybe. So I have some of that stuff. Ornaments. And some random wooden stamps. Never use. No, I don't think. Yeah, I haven't, I haven't used these. Um. Oh, another box in a box. And am I? Oh, the only one that does boxes and boxes. Um, more Dollar Tree. Randomness. I got everything piled up on my table. Um, this is a bag of little cute wooden deer and some bells. Those are from Michael's. The bows from Dollar Tree. More stickers. Cute little stamps that I completely forgot about. More felt pieces. Straws. Some bags with like music note little treat bags, paper bags. Those are will be cool to play with. Straws. Another stamp set, never used. Oh yeah, yay. The um gift card box. Another gift card holder. More random stuff, more stickers. There's some ephemera, random ephemera. ephemera. So that's that. And we're getting to the end. Thank goodness. So I'll have to go back and sort all through this and have to take inventory of what I have. Here's some little button stickers. These are some Dollar Tree deer. But the glitter obviously gets all over. Some cards. Uh, anything interesting in here? Oh, these are cute. Those will be cute. Um, dry embossed or painted. 
little cute little stickers. Oh, these are cute. Oh. Let me see. I got some dies down here. Bells. More stickers. Oh, those are cute. Oh, little Santa. My Santa die. Um, here. Have a little joy die. That'll be cute to work with. And then in the bottom, just some random tags. An ornament with my son's name on it. Some little puck balls and of course more ribbon. Some tags that I could alter. So yeah, y'all, that's my um that's my Christmas bin. <laughs> And it's all on my table now, but at least I can um, go through it and sort it and um, organize it so I can definitely use it this Christmas. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you have, um, enjoyed seeing what a Christmas craft hoarder I am. And I would love to see your videos. Um, I think it's fun to see what everybody kind of keeps in their bins. So when it's coming upon the holiday crafting time, so... Everybody should be start starting to get all of their holiday crafting supplies out of storage and we'll be um, getting, getting to use them up. So thanks so much for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.